It's thousands of one-on-one -on -one conversations that you have to have to reach your goals. I don't care how you have the conversations, but there's no way around that. Okay, that's the one thing about real estate. It's such a sweat equity business. You can't just buy your way into market share. You've got to have all those, even if you did spend tons of money on marketing and Zillow and did all this stuff on social, that's all just to collect data to turn right around and call. <laughs>
uh, I, I'm really trying to establish, bro, who I am and what I want. I don't have like a five year, this is what I want my life to look like right now. Honestly, because like I'm just a grinder and I'm just like, good things will happen. Euphoria is coming if I just keep grinding it out and it will. But what does that look like, man? Because when I'm knocking down three million a month and, and just income that I can sleep all day and that's still coming in, what then? You know what I mean? Like that's where I am with my life is like three million a month coming in income wise doesn't excite me, bro. It doesn't, the money, dude, I lost 200,000, you know this, I, I got hacked for 200,000 in crypto last month and didn't even blink an eye, not because I have a bunch of money, bro, that was like a chunk of my net worth. It was because money doesn't do it for me. When I cut off YouTube ad revenue and I'm spending money on these things and like tired because I flew all day and this, that, and the other, like money is not where it's at for me. Like I can go to sleep right now and wake up to 20 million a year in income, personal income. Right now I can shut off, every, dude, I could erase my social medias, go to sleep, wake up, boom, four years from now, loaded. That's not the thing. All that stuff already in motion for me. So I'm literally like, who am I and what do I really want out of life? You know, what's my definition of success? What's my definition of happiness? You know, like where's the peace? I'm just, guys, listen, I am literally trying to figure out who I am, what I want, and trying to grow into a more leadership position. Um, I've never been in this position before, you know, where I'm having to be a leader. Uh, you know, and I have an opportunity in front of me where I can really make a big difference in the world and I'm not going to let it pass, you know, and it's all going to have to start with me becoming a better person and growing, um, you know, um, growing personally. No, I, I learned a long time ago that when you, and, and I don't, this is not why I do it. I do it because this is real, but I learned a long time ago that in, in the world of communication and showing people that you care about them, you've got to open up and be vulnerable. And when you do that, they feel like they can be vulnerable and open up to you, you know, and, and, it, and it creates a bond, um, you know, and, 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 and it makes people respect you. And, and, and again, it's not why I do it, um, that's just the repercussions of being who I am, but I, all I can be is me, you know, and all I can do is say what's on my mind, you know?